Hi guys, welcome. Let me turn this way because that sun. Oh, look at my skin. Oh, it looks a mess. But anywho, welcome. Today is today is Saturday, and I'm in the office right now. And I'm just here for anyone who wants to come and shop. I gotta do a little bit of work, and customers need to come and pick up their online orders. <clears throat> so if you guys are new here, please hit that subscribe button and become part of part of my YouTube family. And if you've been following me, thank you for coming back to check out another video. So I'm about to eat my lunch. It's a late lunch. Let me show you what I got. This is what I got. I got the club from Sweet Peppers Deli. Um, and I got a side salad. Add, what did I say? Add a, add green onions and add a egg. So I'm about to eat that before everyone starts to come in here. This is kind of like what my office looks like. I'm sure you guys have seen it before. Um, usually when I'm here, I do pull a table out, have all the orders packed. That one has to be shipped, so I'll drop that off once I leave. And this is a rack. That dress fell off the hanger, which is why it is just thrown over there. And I usually just hang the bags here. <clears throat> These have been one of my number one sellers. So I will put the um, website across the screen for you guys to go shop. I have them in four different colors. One is not here, um, but that is a blue. I have a turquoise. Um, I have them in five different colors because this is the eggplant, which is like a purple color. I have it in the pink, and then I also have it in a teal color. The purple and burgundy looks about the same color, but it's not. But I have it in that teal, and I have it in this dark burgundy color. So, watching a little bit of TV while I eat my lunch, show you guys around. And that's basically what my Saturday is up for. My son is invited to a Sweet 16 party today. So my son is invited to a Sweet 16 party today, so I have to go back and get him. It starts at 7. So I'll go back and pick him up at 6. We'll go grab her a gift or we might just give her a card with a gift card or some cash or something like that. And then um, call it a day. So my face is dry. I did grease my scalp. But I'll be back. excited about it because it is an opportunity for me to get my business out there so when I say get my business out there like promote like get everyone to start uh, what am I trying to say um, you know not necessarily expand but up and coming 
trying to get my business out there where more people would know about it, more people would shop, you know, and I can eventually do this full time, which is what I said in my last vlog. I wanted to be able to do this full time. So it's, I have to be there for 9 a.m. and it is about 8 10. So I'm going to stop and get me some breakfast, which is right down the street from it. Um, I do need to play my makeup some more. I was doing my makeup in my nephew's bathroom and the lighting in there is just horrible. So I couldn't really see if I blended it well. And when I got out in the sun to take pictures, um, I saw that it wasn't blended. So I'm going to try my best to get it blended well. But anywho, that is what I'm doing this morning. I did have to work this morning. For, I had to be there for 5 and I told my supervisor, I was like, look, I said, I'm not missing this. I'm sorry, but I'm not missing this for nothing in the world. This is something that is huge for my business. Um, so, but they did have my old business name. Um, and I don't know why, but when they reached out to me, they had my old business name. So I didn't register that business as a LLC. This is the only business that I have registered as a LLC. So I ended up wearing my shirt. Um, but he ended up getting all of that changed. So right now I'm just listening to the breakfast club, trying to get, you know, I'm a little nervous, but it's nothing that I can't handle. I know it's nothing that I can't handle. So yeah. invited out um, to open house um, for iHeart Media. Um, they reached out to me, so to me this is huge. It may not be huge to some people, but it's huge to me. But I was invited out to iHeart Studios, iHeart Media, iHeart Media's open house. Um, they were looking for small entrepreneurs, small business owners, whatever you want to call it, um, to come out to their open house. So I just randomly got a call from them about two weeks ago, um, and invited me out. And, um, for coming, I do have a chance to up to $2,500 to um, $2,500 to do a radio ad for my boutique which if you guys didn't know my small business is Fashion Rags Online Boutique you can shop my website I always have it linked down in the description box and sometimes I will put it across the screen but anywho I was invited out I was supposed to be here at 9 I kind of got here in the parking lot about 8.20 or so, I stopped and got me some breakfast. Um, so I got here at 9, but for coming, I do get a $500 gift certificate to go towards my first radio advertisement. Um, which, I think that's like one commercial from my understanding, but I'm not sure. I have to look into it when I do go in there, but I'm sitting outside right now. I don't go in until 9, but I was just randomly selected and invited out. Somebody called me from here about two weeks ago, and I was like, okay, how do they know about my business? So, sis, there's people out there that know about you and know about your business that you don't even know, like, it's like so much stuff have been just, like, crashing down on me, um, to, I was just crying tears, like, just for no reason. So, now, I, um... 
I feel like doors are being opened. Like I feel like my business is moving into the right direction. And I'm trying not to cry. Um, I feel like my business is moving into the right direction and more people are starting to notice I'm getting orders from out of state. People who I didn't know knew that I sold clothes and they're paying regular price. They're not coming in there. They're not asking for a discount. My biggest issue was people was always asking for a discount and that really made me rethink like am I cut out for this business world or this boutique world whatever you want to call it because I got so many people waiting on stuff I had so many people waiting on stuff to go on sale and I have a couple of people who only buy from me when things are on sale and that's not fair to the people who buy um well I'm not gonna say that's not fair I just you know you want to support a small business don't wait till something goes on sale to purchase it it's good that it does go on sale if it does and if it doesn't see she want it but then to sit there and just let it come out your mouth is this on sale no sis it's not or oh, can i get a discount no you cannot like if it's not a discount if i didn't say it was discounted it's not on sale and it's not discounted so it is what it is at this point but things was just not looking good for me at one point in time i know i expressed in my last video how i've been working myself to death and i feel like i'm not getting anywhere um but things are starting to look a little better for you girls all right guys so i am back and i'm actually out i took a few pictures but not a lot it was other business owners there as well so i'm back in the car i had to stop at the party store to get some balloons because i do need to make a balloon arch for my job and i am now headed to work but i just wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight about what that was about um, it's a great opportunity for local business owners. Basically, what they're trying to do is sell those advertisements that have not been sold. And they are focusing on smaller businesses, smaller local businesses. And one of the, um, one of the examples that they gave was the, the store that's called soul sisters and i remember that commercial and i always wanted to go to that store just to see what they have to offer so needless to say radio advertisement is working they did talk about um how facebook and apple are in a up uproar if that's how you say it um it's like Apple is not going to give Facebook the, um, it's not going to tell Facebook about the users. It has something to do with privacy. You know how Facebook is able to target those, target those people who like golf, who said they went to Dick's Sporting Goods, who went to Dick's Sporting Goods website and put some, um, golf clubs in their cart and never did check out where Facebook tracks that and that is how advertisers are able to target you into shopping with them. So basically, that is what it was pretty much uh, about. Still a great opportunity. We did get a $500 gift certificate to go towards our first radio advertisement. So for $595, I'm able to run about three commercials a day on the local stations here. Um, and I will reach about 60,000 listeners, basically. So, I feel like it's a really good investment. With the $500, I will only have to pay $95, um, up front. Well, I will have to pay $95, basically, with the $500 gift certificate that, um, we received. So, um... 
I feel like it's a great opportunity. I did sign up to start mine in June. So um, I'm going to see if it brings traffic to my website because I wanted to bring traffic to my website. I do want to get my website back to where it needs to be because it's kind of not organized. So yeah, I need it to be organized. I got two orders that I got to get shipped off today. So hopefully I get off work about 6 30 or 7 today i'm scheduled i was scheduled 5 to 2 i'm going in for the 11 to 8 shift but i'm hoping to leave about 6 30 ish so i'm just really in a good mood right now yesterday i had so like literally at the when i first was talking to you guys i uh, was about to cry <laughs> so I'm just trying to keep it together and like right now I'm just smiling from ear to ear I'm having a good day so far you know thanking the man above for giving me the strength to go on to other stuff that's going on in my life uh, other than my business um, I don't really care to share that but just know you do unto others what you will have them do unto you so you don't mistreat people, you don't use people, you don't string people along, all of that kind of sort of thing, and yeah, but I don't want to go into detail, but anywho, I'm just having a really good day right now, and I'm in a great mood, so let's just hope the day goes by and keeps me in this good mood, so right now so when i have something else to talk about i'll come back to you guys hey god it's me again i know i come to you asking you for a lot but today i just want to say thank you i thank you for everything you've done for me and everything that you will continuously do